Standing banded power crunch. Okay, so you're going to need a resistance band. Um, if you're new to this exercise, let's try a little bit thinner resistance band. We're gonna loop it around something sturdy. All right, and then you're gonna carefully step into the band and you're going to put it around, basically around your, your lower back, uh, pretty much where your belly button would be. So if you're new to this exercise, what we're gonna focus on is rounding the lower back and then crunching in by squeezing our core, all right? So to make this a little bit easier, you're gonna to wanna to step in a little bit closer, have a wide stance, you can hold on to the band and just get this movement down to where you're learning how to anteriorly tilt your pelvis and posteriorly tilt your pelvis, which includes some glutes and it's gonna include your core, all right? So get that motion down where you're anteriorly tilting and posteriorly tilting. You wanna think of touching your belly button to your back that will help you engage that core. All right, so to make it easier, hold on to the band here and squeezing and holding. To make it more difficult, step further out and put your hands on your head. And we wanna squeeze slowly and hold it. And then arch the back and round the back. So slow and controlled is the name of the game with this exercise. It's basically a standing crunch, okay? So if you do 10 repetitions, I want you to hold it for at least two seconds, maybe even longer, in that posteriorly tilted position.